Hello everybody and welcome back to Casual Gamer Oz as we move now into round 8 of our fourth season on F1 2017 career mode. Toro Rosso driver Ben Waterworth. My name is Ben Waterworth. We just came from an invitational round here in Azerbaijan. So why not race in Azerbaijan? Let's get into it now. Of course, uh, best qualifying here of 14th back in season 2 on F1 2017. Best race finish of 14th last season here on uh, Casual Gamer Oz on uh, F1 2017. We have only ever finished once at the Azerbaijan Grand Prix, and that was in the last season. So we'll see how we fare again here. Now, uh, an update in terms of our development part. that We had an upgrade to a bit of the fuel tank that was uh, fitted successfully. No failures there, so we were happy with that. Uh, our rivalry with Hulkenberg, we are literally one point behind Nico Hulkenberg in that rivalry. So we're going to try and catch up to him there as I nearly end up in the wall there. And we've also dropped down the difficulty down one notch to 68 just because it was getting a little bit ridiculous there. And this is getting a little bit ridiculous in the fact that we are that close to Lewis Hamilton, but for some reason we are dead last still. As uh, we are going to clip the wall there, damage the front wing. And uh, 17th is where we're expected to finish. And uh, why are we so close but so far behind? What is the deal with this? This is not cool at all. And it's not looking good for our qualifying. And it's not looking good for anything here in terms of our starting position. And where we want to be and where we're going to be. This is uh, disastrous. I'm not sure what is happening in terms of the pace here of this Toro Rosso. Oh, well. That's not a good way to start the weekend. Better in qualifying than in the race. But, uh... Yep. I'm going to fit a new engine for the, uh, for the um, qualifying. What the hell, Ben? <sighs> All right. Disappointed, but uh, we're going to bounce back. We're going to lose some points there for that. We're going to lose development points, and we're going to lose positioning in our rivalry. We're going to lose Nico Hulkenberg now, and we're going to drop down our green scale uh, in our uh, overall capacity. Anyway, let's, um, Hamilton, first time Mercedes got in pole all season, so positives for the Mercedes, um, but I'm very disappointed about that, so let's bounce back for the race and hopefully we can do well with that. Let's do that now. I just don't know what happened there. I think I was just getting myself distracted and ragged at the fact that I was performing so slowly compared to, uh, the car in front, which isn't generally what should happen. Anyway, focus ahead. If we can uh, load this game anytime soon, please, Codemasters. That would be all kinds of fantastic. Today, even, if you don't mind. <sighs> 30 points, wow. I think Hulkenberg's going to have this one now. Okay, well, yeah, we need a miracle to at least tie it. We're not going to be able to win it now. And we're going to drop back two big notches there. All right, let's fit a new engine in. And uh, we will also give ourselves a new gearbox. Because we may as well. We're not going to lose any grid positions. We're last anyway. Yes, we know. 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 All right. Best ever finisher of 14th. That came last season. The only time we've ever finished the Azerbaijan Grand Prix. And uh, hopefully we can match that. A little bit rattled after that uh, qualifying. Very disappointed with myself after that. I'm going to yawn. <sighs> well, try a little bit too with much that, of that. Might ban this video. All right, shut up. Shut up. Shut your mouth, you little twerp. Sorry, Crofty, not a little twerp, actually, like you. Alright, here we go. There's Bajan. Oh, God, that fuel mix is very low. For a new engine, and improved uh, on the petrol side of things. That's quite interesting. Alright, good start here. Very good start. I'm going to jinx that, aren't I? Well, Salva turns in on me. Whoa. It's Hulkenberg. That's our rival. That's who we 
want to get past. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Oh. Don't give me a penalty, please don't give me a penalty. Oh. Oh, I'm just holding onto this by the skin of my teeth. I'm not really saying much here, as you can tell. Just trying to get around a lap here, folks. Trying our darndest. I'm going to put that back to standard mode now because I don't want to run out of fuel in the first lap. Well, you can't run out in the first lap, but you know what I'm talking about. Okay, castle section time. Whoa, very late on the brakes there. Whoa, whoa. All right. And the engine uh, should be better than the Haas, and it's the power section in the second part of this lap. I'm going to say our overall performance has dropped back again behind the McLarens, uh, which uh, is a bit embarrassing. We're now the second worst car again in the field, but um, power-wise, we're uh, right up there as one of the most powerful engines. That's where I've developed it well, but uh, the rest of the car hasn't been developed at all, of course. We're going to catch Grosjean here. Oh, God, I somehow held on to that. Get a vessel. Palmer's racy on me there. Where did you come from, Palmer? Interesting. Both of the Renault engines. But uh, we supposedly are a little bit better on the power stakes than uh, the works team. But uh, we'll keep you behind us there. Thank you, Jolyon. You can just uh, hover around there if you don't mind. Thank you very much. We're going to continue to chase down Mr. Grosjean. David Guetta's bestie. Seem to be closing in on him ever so slightly, which is good. Again, we've nottled down the uh, difficulty level just a tad to 60, uh, 68. We were on 69. Start of the season at 70, but uh, just feel in terms of uh, just the progress that is being made, as we keep saying. So say what you will about that, folks, but we are casual gamer Oz, and that wasn't one of the rules that we implemented on ourselves, that uh, we couldn't change the difficulty. So, uh, we've done we've done that. And again, as long as we don't come out and start winning every race and getting pole in every race, and as you can clearly tell, we're not doing that. It's a battle here at the moment for 11th position as it is. I love how they uh, we crash out here and they put us at to 19th. Monaco, they still think 17th. So, um, I love how they have more confidence around Monaco. There's, there's another thing too that they should implement. They should know your results from previous Grand Prix. So, if they know you like come out and win every time around in Canada then play that into a factor of your thing particularly if you're the same team and even if you're not with the same team well the other teams would have seen your performances I mean I know that's probably a little bit more of a complicated algorithm that they have to put into the game but uh, you know just something put up to rich mode here on the main straight extra power and all that jazz whack it back out Right up into Grosjean here. Palmer's still hanging around on the back of me. Interesting. I think we're ahead of Hulkenberg too, aren't we? So, I think we are. Maybe we're not. I'm pretty sure I remember passing Hulkenberg. You remember passing Hulkenberg? I'm pretty sure we did. Well, it's not going to matter. The best case scenario, we can tie the, uh, the rival. We can't win it outright, so... We still will go without having won a rivalry. Tying will be the closest we would have gotten to doing that, of course. Whoa, no, no, no. Oh, no, he's clipped it. He's damaged a bit of the front wing. That's not good. That's not good. Shut up, Jeffrey. Please just shut up. God, I wish you could mute him sometimes. If he's an option, you can. Uh, but I think you need him, actually, uh, to focus and tell you to do certain things sometimes. So it's not a case of clearly muting him completely. I didn't say anything, Jeff. I'm not. I'm just talking about you, not to you. I don't know how he can hear me. I've got no microphone connected to the controller. Anyway. I'm a bit wary coming full speed into this section. Had a bit of curb there. 
whack open the uh, full rich revs. Harmer's going to get a good run on me here. Not quite. Oh, feel that going into that corner there. I think those yellow uh, engine covers are the Red Bulls, aren't they? They kind of, from a distance, look like they might be a Renault. But we've got one Renault behind me, so they can't be too ahead of me. And I'm 98% certain that uh, Nico Hulkenberg is behind me. Obviously, my teammate is, oh shit, oh shit, he's behind me. God damn it. You're losing it, Ben. You are losing it. Stroll, Magnussen. Oh god, is Hulkenberg 15th? Is he really that far back? Maybe he is ahead of me. God, this is going to be tense. I can really start to feel the damage on the car now. Kind of does creep into it in the second part of the race. Oh, this castle section gives me the shits. Oh, God. Oh, God. <sighs> Very quiet and calm. You're probably thinking this Grand Prix compared to a lot of other races. I'm just trying to concentrate a little bit more. I really am trying to concentrate a little bit more. Because it's this race that I generally don't finish. I've only finished here once before. And this will do us very well for our uh, R&D points as well as our reputation. It's a little bit nervous. Why did I whack that down? I need that up here into the straight. Oh, feathering the throttle here. Oh god, Palmer is all over me. He's all over me like a rash. And I can't sustain rich mode for much longer. Fuel saving, I'm going to have to put into play here. And, you know, this whole fuel tank issue that has supposedly improved doesn't do that much of an improvement. As I cut across him just enough to give him a little bit of a scare, I think we can last this lap with it. If we get below 20, then we will, uh, we will cut it down. But right now we're on 34, so we should be fine. Sitting here in 11th, it's 8 ahead of where they want us to finish. I'm nervous. I'm just... Uh -oh, oh, no, 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 God, no. Oh. Still time to bend this. This is the quietest I think I've ever been on casual game of in a race, isn't it? It's almost dead silence in concentration here as I just limp back home here. Right now, you think this is me trying to limp home for a championship. It's just literally me limping home to get 11th place. Get my reputation back up a snotch. And uh, find myself through to a only a second ever Azerbaijan Grand Prix finish. With a damaged car. Okay, we're under 20. We're going to switch it back to standard. It's the last thing we want. Oh, God. So close there to the wall. Just don't trust this car to go full speed with the damage that I've got. Oh, got a bit of curb there. That's not good. Tell you one thing. Cars ahead aren't pulling away as much as they usually do. It's probably a little bit down to the difficulty change. All right, you've just got to make it through here and hopefully don't get dragged across the line. Hamilton wins the Grand Prix. All right, you've got it, Ben. You've got it. Oh, shit. Palmer's got me here. Palmer has got me. I have to weave around in there. Oh, I wouldn't do that in an online mode. Palmer is just getting very aggressive with me. Palmer's getting very aggressive with me. He's clipping me. He's clipping me. We got 11th. Oh, God, you sneaky little Brit. Whew. Our second ever Azerbaijan Grand Prix. We finished eight Grand Prix from the beginning of the season in a row. That's 10 in a row, folks, off the last two last season. We're just not getting the points. All right, yeah, 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 Mercedes won two. So let's just have a look at the replay off the start. So we got a good start, considering we were last, and we got to 11th. Actually got a very good start. If you see here, door closes on me there from the Renault. Get pushed out of it slightly by the Sauber. It's pushing my teammate. So the Renault is very far back there. So I think we did finish ahead of Hulkenberg. Because he's all the way up there. Pretty sure I remember passing Hulkenberg early on. We go through that bit. Yep, no, it was. That was Hulkenberg. So Hulkenberg is definitely behind. So there you go. Um, I finished ahead of Hulkenberg. Woohoo.
Uh, standings. Vettel, Raikkonen, Hamilton, Cole, Perez moves up a notch there, and it's Force India who are doing very well this year, more than uh, Williams, as you can see there in the Constructors' table as well. So they've done some improvements on the car as well. All right, so we are off to Austria next, and um, we will move forward there a little bit further. But thank you for tuning to Casual Gamer Oz. We're off to a good start to this season so far. Hopefully we can continue that on. Remember to like, subscribe, and comment, and uh, we appreciate you joining us once again. We'll speak to you in Austria. Good night.